day three of our holiday drinks. Our 12 days of cocktails, Christmas cocktails. I know you're wanting the Grinch, and so that's what I'm gonna do today. The Grinch is one of everybody's just favorite cartoons. I think the cartoon, the original one is the best, but a lot of people like the movies. This is going to be a green Christmas cocktail, of course, and we're gonna do it uh, kind of in the style of Seuss, so it's gonna be a little, a little wacky looking. I got a stemless martini glass to do the drink in. And what I did, if you could see, is basically you can potato peel an apple, circle a green apple, and if you do the circle in the glass and then put ice in the middle, it can kind of wrap around your glass. It looks really good in a tall, thin glass too. If you wanna do that, that would be perfect. Uh, and if you don't have time for that bullshit, don't do it, so <laughs> it's okay. You can do like a green apple on the side or something. Apple is really not necessary as a garnish, but I thought it looked kind of cool. So that's our glass. Here's our booze. I'm gonna do Bacardi rum, clear. Make sure it is not dark rum. Apple puckers for the green. And then we're going to mix pineapple juice, ginger beer. So this is almost gonna be like a tiki kind of drink with the pineapple, the ginger, all those flavors. So it's gonna be really tasty. We're gonna add a dash of bitters at the end because the Grinch is pretty bitter. So let's make our drink. We're gonna do it in a cocktail shaker. Shot of rum. Shot of puckers. You can go heavy on the puckers in this drink because you want it very green. So don't hold back. The funny thing about puckers is it's not that, it's a really thin liquor, it's sugary but it's not thick, so sometimes you can lose the green. That's why I said clear rum. If you do any other colors, it could change quickly to where you don't get that bright green. And you want the bright green. Um, on the little pineapple juice, if you do the can, make sure and shake it first because it all settles at the bottom. And once you've opened it, you cannot shake it. So let's pour some juice. We'll do a glug of pineapple juice. And I'm gonna use my, this is my favorite. It's just so good. I think I've talked to you about it before, but Bundaberg, um, Australian ginger beer. It's fantastic. So let's do a glug of that in there as well. You can top the drink with this because it is fizzy, but I put it in my, <laughs> In my shaker so let's hope it doesn't explode uh i'm gonna do orange bitters one dash bitters are always you know you do too many it's too much so one dash <clears throat> it already smells amazing i'm gonna shake <coughs> excuse me lightly as long as it's mixed and then you're going to pour it in strain it looks pretty green and i'm going to top this with a bright red maraschino cherry so one of the old school like uh, fruit salad cherries right on top Oh, that's very grinchy. Do you see? Do you love it? And it's going to taste amazing too, so. Yeah, that tastes like a tiki drink. Um, you will thoroughly enjoy this. If you're feeling a little down, if it's snowing where you are and it's too cold and you want, like, you know how margaritas are like sunshine and people get lifted with that, this is like that. It's very sunshiny. It's an uplifting drink. It will make your heart grow. 
your little black heart. So enjoy this. Make it the Grinch. More to come. Happy holidays. Bye.